Hey over there, Joe Lunchbox. And it's getting, getting ready to be a childlike wife, Joy Nightingale here. And on today's adventure, we have landed here in Ellisburg, Pennsylvania, at an amusement park that we've recently discovered. We came here last year for my birthday, and uh, it's pretty fun. It is nice. And I'm trying to go around the country ride all the dark rides and all haunted houses, fun houses, stuff like that. And, and cool stuff. They have <laughs> two here, so I liked it. And when I came just to do that, I fell in love with the amusement park itself. So you get to all come with us today Yay. as we go explore Knobles, which is America's largest free amusement park. Free, not the rides are free, but no, you could, like we didn't even have to pay for parking. Yeah, there's no fee for we parking. We don't even have to like pay to get in, like Six Flags. Would. It's weird. There's actually even not even a gate around the spot. You park and you can walk in anywhere, walk out. There's picnic fields. There's all this. There's free shows, and the rides you pay per ride on. on Weekdays, you could pay for a group thing, like I mean, uh, all the rides day pass thing. And I think you and think like after a certain time, it's also some of the weekends, yeah, where it's just like pay one price. But the rides you would think, like, ah, six, seven dollars a ride. No, some rides are a dollar fifty to three dollars if that the big what crazy else? roller coasters Ooh. are four dollars. But I love this spot, <laughs> we're gonna have a good day here. So, um, step right up, let's go for this ride. Don't take my word for it. You could take Cosmos. Where to begin? Where to begin? How about right here where we are? And then we're gonna. This is where I'm excited to get up here again. Ooh, you're in store for some treats. Going up. Going down. With us today, Margarita Mama. We'll be building the loaf food stand in the shape of a loaf of bread. I love buildings in the shape of things. Oh, this is Skyway. Yep, there is a sky lift. We're gonna go on that later. I think we're gonna head to some dark rides to start the day. Cool little ice cream guy. Two dollars worth of tickets to go on the gallon pirate ship. Apple shaped building. Ooh, apple cider. This still has to be one of my favorite rides. First time I saw it, I thought they go on their head, but the cars actually turn when they get to the top. So you never go upside down, even though it looks it. This park is in a valley and it's cool little signs you find on stuff that in 2006 this was the flood level. 2011 there's the flood level. Joy, that's that's up to your neck. I'm glad we didn't come in 2011 because you would have been pretty wet. This wouldn't have been a muse park park. It would be a water slide park that day. Water slide? Walking through the kitty area park and I noticed there's actually a blacksmith and craft area up ahead. Oh. Check that out quickly before we... Uh, Head on uh, to our haunted house that I'm heading to. I think this is so happening. This is so going on right now. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> no, not working. <laughs> I'm still going for the witch. my favorite thing. <clears throat> Are my jokes too corny for you? This is awesome. My mom's claiming the bench. It would be cool. We have a bobcat and a bear on each guarding you. 600 year old redwood. Interesting. This section cuts 60 feet above the ground. That's Some cool stuff here in Knobles. Like, I, you think you come to a music park just for rides, but I like all this other stuff they have here. I like I like some of these ladybugs and these. But, but, but look at the little bears over there, Joy. Say welcome. Joy, my butt wouldn't fit. Oh no, wrong butt, wrong butt. What butt are they talking? Oh, oh Bad yeah, butt. I forgot that. I don't have those. My mom has a pig collection home. We might need one of these little 
little, little pigs to come home with us today. Ma, you feel like adopting a pig today? I don't know, maybe. We'll see. Welcome bear, $50. Interesting. All this cool stuff. Like, look at these, some of these cool carvings. The Grinch. I'd get a fishing frog for in front of our house. Dun -dun. Dun -dun. Joe, have you ever seen the movie The Revenant? Yeah, why? Um, no particular reason. Okay. <laughs> now, just so you people, I like on roadside attraction stuff. In Louisville, Kentucky, in front of the Louisville Slugger plant, they have a giant baseball bat, and it says, world's largest baseball bat. Now, the, people could argue this because the bat isn't actually made out of wood. So it's not a real baseball bat. But here in Knobles, over here, they have, which might be the world's largest baseball bat, and it's made out of wood. 14 foot. That's, That's a big old bat. Okay. And if you like stuff, they do. Custom mark here. Ooh. So dads, when you bring your kids to amusement parks and kids going on the ride, you can have custom wood carved just for you. <laughs> Old tools. It's a stone wheel. They're not lying, folks. That is stone. <laughs> Guys, carving the wood right here. Get your own signs made. Nothing licensed, trademark, patented, NFL or Disney. When I upgrade from sideshow to circus, I got a new act. Ready? Go. The Lion Tamer. <laughs> lion Tamer. I did it. I did it. I stuck my head in the lion. Oh, I did it. Mom's taming the lion. She needed a job in the circus. We're up to why we came here, Joy. I found it. The Haunted Mansion. A terrifying adventure in the dark. Wow. The Haunted Mansion is not included. It always is an additional $2 per person. Warning, this ride can be scary. And another cool thing about this park, you can bring your dogs. Joy, was he afraid of Haunted Mansion? Is that why he's barking? I think so. We have a whole backstory here. The former mansion, owner of this mansion. I don't think we're going to make the time to read the backstory. I hope I know what to prepare myself. I'm nervous. Merlin! Ah! It's dark and spooky, Joy. Like jungle that has the monkeys that at the was, end right that there. Was cute. Yeah, the, end was thing. Cute. the haunted mansion is terrifying. No, it's great. You go, it is great. Everybody has to go. Everyone, clap them to their feet and cheer. Joy, cheer. Huzzah! Huzzah! The little kids all were made knights and <laughs> trolls and goblins. Uh oh, we better get out of here. Once Pride. upon a time, you show. The gypsy princess Pride. Nice! Carousel Museum, free admission. Also is the brass ring gift shop. Oh, sorry, no four-legged pets allowed in the Carousel Museum. I'm looking this this throw of all the rides here in Knovels. Yes, I like We entered, it's weird, Joy. You enter into the gift shop and instead before the museum instead of exit. Well, you do have to exit as well. So one of the things I really like about Knovels 
Hydra mm. is that throughout the museum, peppered throughout the museum, let's say, see the food joke because I'm lunchbox? Oh, 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 There's smart. all these little museums. Um, right now we're in the Carousel Museum. There's also a museum about Canobles itself, one about old minings. We are in a mining area of Pennsylvania. And uh, I like that they have these free museums. Like like I said, you could just walk into the park. If you don't go on many rides, you literally could walk and see all the shows. Like a zero dollar day. Go into all these museums and not spend a cent, which is pretty cool. We obviously are going on some rides and <laughs> buying too many souvenirs. I have an addiction to amusement park theme park souvenirs. Stop. But right now, let's look at some old uh, carousels. I think this is my or favorite. carousel horses. This one is like my favorite museum. This primitive line from 1870, 1880. I don't know where this one was, but I'm a fan of Mr. Pig here. He last rode in Jenkins Playland at Point Pleasant Amusement Park. They still have a nice boardwalk fun house there. We got to go there one day soon. Do not get on or off the carousel while in motion. Well, you don't have to worry because this one isn't moving. I do love these old ones that you see the patina on in a very raw looking jumping horse from 1910s. This is one of my favorite ones here, this jumping horse where he's not really painted and it's this raw wood. Yeah. But like this one from Brooklyn, New York. They're both from Brooklyn. Yeah, they were made at Charles Camel from Brooklyn, New York made these two. Cool picture here of the carving shop at Coney Island, making those carousel horses. We're learning about the different styles of the carousel horse. The Phil Doug style was more graceful. Coney Island was a little more flamboyant and country. Fair was a simpler design, because it was portable, of course. Headphone Rudolph. You did find Rudolph. Actually, no, it's considered prancing deer, but I'm calling it him Rudolph. It is a prancing deer. I do agree that he should be called Rudolph, even though he has deer antlers. <laughs> there actually is a lead horse on the carousel, and he's usually the fanciest horse, and he usually has armor on him. And he's usually at the beginning of an outside horse, you know, so he's on the outside, and uh, he moves. Joy, if only Al Bundy was here, he could tell us how we score touchdowns at poke high but there's the two ones. This one is a German horse, and it was wood like that, but it was wrapped in fiberglass. So because of that, you actually can see the wood deteriorated underneath. Yeah, the this isn't a traditional carousel horse. We saw one of these at Rye Playland. This is actually a derby horse for one of the more racing, but I've never seen a derby horse that actually has two-seated derby horse. We learned this horse is Mel. He's actually the lone survivor from Knobel's first carousel. Knobel was rescued after flood, because after he was here, he was moved to Bushkill Park in Easton, PA. They rescued him after flood, and he's back here. I like this standing camel. Enjoy his little favorite, the elephant. I didn't realize how vicious the pig looked before when I was filming the pig's face. <laughs> Joy, you were excited for the carousel? Carousels are my thing. so many gifts. No, I, I like this show. The we're, we're trying to get out of the gift shop. Mom's still finding stuff. Here's your size. Joy, when you come to the mountains of Pennsylvania, what's the first thing you think of? Mountains? Trees? Not live hermit crabs? Oh In the pirate ship gift shop here at Knobles. How about some Florida instead? Yeah. Or diet tasty treats. Wait, as seen on the Food Network? Maybe one day. On a little bit of line. Joy, tell the fine folks home what we're about to go on. Um, the second one of the dark ride? Was it a mansion type? I mean, it is I another wanted, dark ride. We're about ride. to go on the Black Diamond Mine. But not that far away from Knobles is a town that we've been to called Centralia. Awesome. Which underground mine fires closed down that town. This 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 dark ride is based off that town. It must be as tall as this pickaxe to ride this ride. 42 inches. I just made it, Joy. Just made it. Joy, be careful. Don't get too close. You're so hot, you might sit off the explosives. Sorry folks, not gonna film this one. You just gotta come to check it out yourself. But it's a good one. We just got off the black mining ride. It's amazing, amazing. It's part roller coaster, part haunted house. Only one I've ever seen like that. 100% amazing. Based on a real event, like it's cool. A little scary, 
little gross. There's an eyeball hanging at the end. Eyeballs creep me out. Don't want to ruin it for you though. Go on this ride. Come here, go on this ride. Remember folks, Black Diamond Mining Company. Has anyone ever told you you're the bomb? Bomb diggity? Bomb diggity bomb bomb. Scooby Scooby Doo, where are you? You're here at Knobles, guarding the train. Hey! Hey baby, you wanna come on and go for a ride? <laughs> I don't know if it seems that very cozy here. Oh no, the problem is it is too cozy. It is too cozy? <laughs> This is cool. You have like the chairs over on this side. It also. is nice. I love their little old. Yeah, but to fit like all the people in here. It would be really hot with all this metal and all the people if there was some taxis still working. Yeah. Well, we are going to go on some cool train rides, which I'm excited for. Just want to come sit in the old one. Just get a feel. Now, like I was saying, there's no fences for this park. We just get off the, the mine ride. And right here, they actually have little cabins you can rent. I don't like admitting it. I do though. I, I have been balding for the past few years. I used to have hair down to here, hard to believe. So when I come to Knobles, I come to see my brother. Your they're, brother. They're American heroes, folks. They are. The bald eagles. All these bald eagles are rescues from injuries that they've been found. They won't be able to survive in the wild, so they hang out in uh, Knobles for the rest of their life. I like one walks away and the other one just hops on over. He's like, no, you're supposed to be close to me, right? Right? It's like Joy, whenever she goes away, I'm like, no, come over, come back, come back. Oh, aren't we so cute? Aren't we? Been together 20 years and I still love her like the first day I met her, folks. The majestic bald eagle. People, people think eagles have this majestic sound. They don't, they sound really weird. And whenever you've seen eagles in movies, they voice over all the eagles. Don't be shy, buddy. Come on, say hi. Inside the International Cafe, and I had to show you, the signs are so cool. The pigs will fly for their pulled pork sandwich, Bavarian ham sandwich, and I love this. Zombie fries. They're good for your brains. Not bad, I got my little quick snack, folks. 375 burrito, the size of my face. <laughs> Yeah, now it's difficult holding it back together. <laughs> it's pretty good. It's pretty good. It tastes more like a giant soft taco than a burrito, but I like it. I think that's just how you folded it back. <laughs> you can see back how soldiers lived in 1861 to 1865 here, right next to this train. Joy, you've been working on a railroad all oh, live long day. These kids look like they're playing on it though, not really working on it. Old 99, wow. It's only older, two years older than the Knobles Park. That's pretty cool. But here we have this big rock. You would think it's a big rock. It's actually a 2,560 pound piece of coal. That's why it's a coal miner guy. Bronze statue paying tribute to all the mines around here. Enjoy. There's gold in those hills and they're gonna mine it right here in this bucket mining. Going into the old mine. Ooh, Black Diamond Mine. There's a cool t-shirt. We're, we're in gift shop number two because we're about to go into the coal mine museum and the Knobel Museum. Help us preserve history. Do not play this piano, but you could put two quarters in it. I think I'm gonna. We got, got a, some. We gotta play the play piano. Yeah. some old helmets of miners. You know where all this coal comes from and oils and all that? It comes from the earth, which is here many, 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 many years. And you know what was there? <sighs> Dinosaurs! Ah! Ooh, actually, foot urn, recovering from the mining operation. I think I'll touch it. Look, we're gonna touch a fern. This oh, fern? Yeah. It's 250 million years old, and I'm touching it. <laughs> Do you think if cavemen were vegan, they would use coal? Think about it. Mind blown. 
You might see Joy right here standing next to this miner. And you're like, oh, that's a cute mini stove trip. No, that's not why he's small. This little section here is about something called the Breaker Boys. Miner's life began early, something to the age six, usually eight or nine. Really cool inside of the Fabergé egg type thing. A little mine display. We have all these cool. Look at the matches mine. and the pins. Mm -hmm. Some sections on the railway because they used to use it. I love the insulators. Oh. We have a cool model here. I don't think it's working anymore. Looks like the uh, train car has been derailed, but this is definitely a cool miniature model of a mine. What are you reading, Joy? Um, just accident reports in the mine. Is it like accident reports when I was a young kid in Boy Scouts? I was totally thinking about that. I was like, how many times can I find this one person's name? My, my best friends, though, I still don't see them that often. Garrett, we had a Boy Scout accident report, and every other thing was Garrett. Like, Garrett got rash from tubing. Garrett got glow stick, goo in his eye. It was always a funny one. It was all about coal. We can't, they have the old stove, but mom, I'm very upset. Why? I was hungry even after my burrito, but we're here on a Sunday and kitchen closed Sundays. Oh, used for construction, transportation, commerce, and power. So that was the mining museum here in Knobles. You might think, oh, that was cool. Another second museum. But wait, there's a third. It's the history of Knobles itself. The old print press. Ooh. There's some cool stuff. It is a cool jukebox. All the old stuff. I love the bear show. Country bear jubilees. Any animatronics are my favorite. Oh, that was the first wheel. And then actually, the Ferris wheel. And these six foot, here's crazy. Imagine that. Everything on the water. Interesting, a German carousel acquired by Donnie Park in 1966. Oh. It actually had little rides the kids would ride in, like this school bus. Here's, here's the seal that was at the top of it. There's a photo of little kids in their cars and the school buses on that carousel. This one of my favorites. I've seen love testers. I wish this one were. This isn't any love tester. This is your circus romance. 1959, then 1993, now. Well, Management's Peerless. Waiting vending machine, the fortune teller. The new playland, 1950. Exit through the gift shop. And it's a cool gift shop. I like the little coal figurines. Yeah, We're looking there. at these cool coal sculptures, figuring out what to get. I showed Joy a little over outfit. Over there, they have the oven. I, I like, like the this oven. pig over here. And also some cool postcards here. I'm not gonna put a dollar on Pappy, you wanna know why, Joy? Why? He's just gonna tell us to stay out of that black diamond mine. Yup. Phoenix, getting ready to go. One of their two wooden roller coasters here at Kenobo. And they claim it's the world's finest wooden roller coaster. <laughs> One cool thing about Knobles is it, we're here in the middle of July and they have Christmas in July. So we're gonna go into this Christmas store here in Knobles open year round. I'm first gonna go to the North Pole. <laughs> you feel it? It's really ice. The Christmas cottage. Gifts for the Yuletide season. Santa's Express here. Maybe he's even here. There is one specific thing that I actually came to Gnobles I want to pick up. You'll see what it is. Oh, no. It's in this store right here. Another one's coming to Gnobles. We gotta come back in 2019. Oh my that's god. It. That's foreshadowing what I want. This is insane. Yeah. Those are there. That's why he came here. 
think Christmas Chef was a success. <laughs> I have at home. I haven't made a full display yet, but I collect Lionel trains. And I just got the Knoebel School engine, the little coal car, and the caboose. Enjoy, got me my first box car. This is one of the coolest rides here Canola, one of the reasons I come here. The bobsled type roller coaster called Flying Turns. There is no track. Look at that wood barrel. Your car literally goes turn and turn and turn. We're in the viewing area right now, waiting for a car to pass us. It's pretty, pretty amazing. Feet of engineering, building a power. I hear it. Joy, I think we made a wrong turn. Why? Well, we were in Pennsylvania. Yeah. yeah. And now I think we might be in Arkansas or, oh. or Missouri, because we're in the southern Ozarks. That's definitely, where did you take us? We got a hillbilly. You know how you can tell he's a hillbilly? He barefoot. <laughs> oh. Hillbilly shooting gallery. I like this guy in the bed. So we got some egg on his head. Skunko, we're gonna have fun with this one. Ah. Oh. oh, he's like, oh, that's cool. cool. That's really awesome. <laughs> I got him, he talked to me. I know, but still. Oh, she, she scares me. You know how many I got? How I got many? 16. Ah. 16 out of 16, not bad today. So right now, we're in front of the Stone, Stony Gable, which was originally built in 1933. Right now, it's their fudge shop, which I'm gonna go get one of my favorite treats. It's the only spot in the world I've ever seen this type thing. You'll be surprised at what it is. I'll give you a hint. This is a fudge shop. It involves fudge. But this actually was one of the early cottages when this Knobles area was made. We're gonna get some fudge, but we're gonna get the special treat I can't pay for. Can I get one of those, uh, yeah. uh four a chocolate frozen wurzel? Yeah. And we're gonna get some fudge. How much fudge do you want? I wanna try, uh, there you go. Look at that. That's pretty cool. I see that. Do you want some awesome. maple walnut? And key lime. We're gonna do maple walnut. We're gonna do key lime. We're gonna do rocky road. Which one? Um, gonna get fudge. Said one. And here's what it is, folks. We just got out of the fudge shop, and they have something called Whirls. Do so I got a mochaccino Whirls at the fudge shop? I got a chocolate. It's a milkshake that they actually put their fudge in, and I love it. I'm gonna try it for you. Hey, over there, the flavor. Ah. Knobles knows how to do it. They were telling us in there. Disney used to make these. They stopped. This is the only theme park in America that you could get a milkshake with fudge made in it. So let me try that mochaccino. Hand over your chocolate. Give me one second. Give me one second. Uh oh, I'm dying over here. Oh, yeah. That's probably going to great. No, 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 no. <laughs> hey. Oh, yeah. Mocha. The chocolate is good, but I really like about mine. about three and, hour, three and a half hours away from this park. I'll be honest. I did come to get one of these. <laughs> Kids said hello to you all on YouTube. No complications on lifting the box <laughs> with the <Okay>. drink. <laughs> the struggle was real. <laughs> all right, bottoms up. Tastes like a chocolate drink. And me and mom know we love our ice creams. Enjoy one her off. She doesn't want to give her, her flavor. Look at her, she's just drinking away her mochaccino. Enjoy a frozen world fudge drink. Made fresh inside. Oh, I did. Right here in the fudge kitchen. Spin, 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 you crazy whirlwind flyers. <laughs> it's not actually me singing. <laughs> Ride them all, Joy. All the rides. Except the little kitty one. All the rides. <laughs> Getting ready for the Pioneer train. You ready, Joy? I am. We, she got tickets. We bought the train. Now we're going to ride a train. In fact, here it comes. Oh, they, have a, they have a new diesel and they have the old uh, steam locomotives. We're going we're gonna to ride the steam locomotive is one we got. Pioneer train coming into the station. Everyone ready to ride the train?
Yes, there's actually dogs riding the trains here. This is the pool area and you have a big seat. They have a big rope course and jungle gym, which is cool. Not open at the moment, it doesn't look, but look at that, Joy. We're going under the water slides. Might get a little scary. We're going through the tunnel. Since 1865. Oh, passing another train. We have the deer feeding station. No deer for us today. But you can see they have the corn set up for all the deers to come eat. Joy, did you see it over there? What? It was Bigfoot. Oh. I saw a big... No? No. Back through the tunnel alone. Look, Joy, Joy, look. Look, we're gonna watch the splash that mountain, maybe. Just going for it. Right in the Ferris yeah. wheel. Oh, the giant Woo! wheel. They call it a giant wheel here at this point. Got stopped on top. We got a nice cool breeze. Yeah. Nice Chevrolet. Used for the flood cleanup at June 972 and various home duties. Since by restored in 2017, currently used for special occasions. So if I say it's my birthday, is that a special occasion? It's always special occasion. Today is lunchbox day, I do declare. Going for the Skyway, I like Cosmo and his Lederhosen's. It is one of the more expensive rides in the park, but it is one of the best views in the park. So it is worth $4. We made it. We're on the scenic skyway, enjoying the views. We're going up right now. The view actually of the park is when we come down. But still, it's the same to see like where we go. We do. We have a ridge. We're going to see what's on top, then loop around and look at the park. We were just informed we're coming up to pole number four, but there was a little kid that said there's a snake in the tree or on the trail once we get to number five. Oh no, they're pointing. Everybody's pointing. They, point, they, 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 they see the snake. Oh my god, thanks. Great. <laughs> it seems to be high. Joy's getting afraid because it's on her side. Oh my god, yeah. That's it. There's a black snake right there in the tree. Oh, Everyone, right everyone's right telling us. Right as you the black snake in the tree up there. Oh, right there. I see it, Joy. <laughs> there he is, folks. The black yeah. snake in the tree. We just took on, we're spinning around. Watch, 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 the car's gonna be released back. Time to go down and enjoy the view. I wonder if like everybody passed along the note of like, hey, there's a snake over there. And there's the view, folks. The beautiful view of Canal Balls. With the pool and everything. And you get the pool and twister in the distance. We gotta, we gotta let these people know. There's a snake. There's a... He's just chilling there, the snake in the tree. Just coming in. We gotta get ready. We have to prepare to unload. Joe, you got your gun? We gotta unload it. I'm gonna feed the pig paper. I got a paper. Hey, pig. I, I realized what you're supposed to do. I messed up. What, right? what are you supposed to do? Going into the Alamo. 
So we're sitting in the Alamo and we came in right at the right time. We're looking at the menu. I'm gonna have a hot roasted sandwich. But right when we came in, the rain started. Now look at this out here. Perfect timing. Perfect timing to have a nice hot meal. This cool uh, Southwest themed restaurant here in Knobles. With um, American ice. Yeah, yeah, some good food. <laughs> For amusement park food, it's a good sandwich. I'm, yeah. I like that. I like a sit down restaurant instead of just out there walking around. Like everybody else? <laughs> sandwich? Yeah, someone had the hot roast sandwich. So we got our nachos. I'm going to tell you a little secret. As we got the nachos, we want you all to see. But I also want Joy to film this. So I could take time. <laughs> TV all these nachos while she's filming. You are horrible. Mm -hmm. I'm so I have those nachos. I ate two rolls. Half of Mama's turkey club sandwich. My whole roast beef sandwich. With a side of mashed potatoes, corn and gravy. Joy ate a turkey sandwich covered in gravy and mashed with potatoes. potatoes on the side. <laughs> I am full <clears throat> now, as you can see. I am a big man, but this is a little smaller. It is, definitely. Now we're going to go ride a carousel. Hope this ends well. Oh my god, I, I don't think it might. <laughs> Probably one of the first times in history, someone who's welcome to the Alamo. Because I can tell you one thing, Davy Crockett wasn't. But mom, mom made a new friend. About to go on the carousel. This one goes a little bit fast. To get on a horse or to sit in a thing. Well, Me and you're going to have many people, so you know right away. Thing with her. Joy wants to drop off her things because this isn't like every carousel. This is an old school carousel. We still can reach out and grab that brass ring. Joy's getting ready. She's getting ready for the serious ring grabbing activity. There it is. You got to throw them in the lion's mouth, grab rings from there. These old placards. This one is for this lighthouse here, showing that this lighthouse along the creek built in 1930. One of the earlier things here at Knobles. It's like when you're young and they measure you. I'm in between 2006 and 2000 level. These are the crazy flood level. Scroll around though, do a, do a thing. Do a thing? I'm doing the thing. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so doing the thing. <laughs> The water was that high at one point. She's done clowning around here at Knobos. She had all the fun there is to have, and she made a new friend with this clown. Maybe and his a little butt. dog. <laughs> she went for it. She sat on the wet bench totally for the good of the shot. Amazing park here. We love it here. Hi. Thanks for having a good place. That is insane. I like that. The teacup. Yeah. That is pretty cool. These food pavilions are actually really cool. The lights around in the ceilings revolve as you're eating your food. One of the cutest little totem poles I've ever seen. That is cute. Found the entrance. <laughs> oh, you just gotta do a steer. <laughs> Why am I hugging the side here? <laughs> we're going, we're going. Enjoy, just make sure you dust. Oh my god, I know. <laughs> I like, they're actually real boats. This is going we're, cool. We're not on tracks, folks. We are, we are steering the boat. 
Let's not try to ruin this thing. <laughs> As I ask you a question? Yo. The answer now must be I I Captain. <laughs> Are you having fun? <laughs> I I Captain. Ah. <laughs> I keep oversteering and <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> I might have just crashed into a wall. But if you look at the one, it looks like a lot of people have crashed into the wall with their phone. Oh my god, seriously. <laughs> we go under Joy, make oh. sure you show everyone the gum wall. Ew, 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 ew. Oh we this is for our friend Heather, you know who you are. Even the boat goes under a little roller coaster. Oh that's cute. Are we gonna have a roller coaster go above us? I feel chipped. No, there's people loading on it. Too long. Oh no, we are, we are going. Ah! Oh. I'm turning it as far as it goes, too. Yeah. <laughs> that is Pence Cape Pants inside boat. Because you might have a driver like this. I keep turning and it's not going. It's weird. I'm going and all of a sudden it starts then going and not going. <laughs> and I don't know why this thing moves straight. <laughs> It was the hardest thing I've probably ever heard. <laughs> Joy. Yes. Here's a question for you. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I was supposed to answer aye aye, Captain. Sorry. Joy, here's a question for you. <laughs> yes. Do you think this boat is front or rear wheel drive? Neither, because it's a boat. <laughs> you have to pay attention. This is like the road. of water. Think about that. So for all the dogs we've seen, I guess when they're bad, they all go to the dog pounder. That is cute. You have to get the dog balls in the dog's belly. Giant wheel is lit up for the night as we're getting ready to go. It was a good day. You see the sun starting to set. We're glad after we finish eating. The rain obviously let up. We got to go on a few more rides. Yes. Had a full day. Well, way too many souvenirs. Way too many. I wasn't planning to buy a whole Lionel train set at an amusement park. I sort of did. Oops. Oops. But, um, Knobles, been there, there, done that. that. And for all of you at home, safe travels, good eats, and live life.